channel. Hello everyone, um, I actually was getting quite a lot of messages disappointed that Dolly Robot has been cancelled on the Kickstarter campaign. I'm actually got it as well because I was very likely to be the first person to review it so that I could let you guys know. But anyhow, um, we all know that robotic business is very risky and so on. But as a good news is that a, another robotic company called Newer Robotics approached me on my email asking whether I'll be interested to review the robot called Kebby. Okay, so it's actually full name is Kebby Robot Creator DX. Um, so this relates to coding and so on, but just want to show you some of the uh, images that, so that you can actually paint the case so that probably you can make it look like an Iron Man kind of thing because I can see this guy painting red. That looks pretty cool. So case painting, open source 3D printed accessories, different light shades and so on. Uh, so different light shades, you can see that there's a skeleton cool logo on it as well. Now um, it comes with 107 parts to assemble and more. So you can see the main screen that looks like Jivo in some way or uh, Misa the robot. I think that was the other one. And that's the box I think and the other component as well. So perhaps it's going to be a bit more complicated than I thought. I actually hope that it was going to come in one pieces, but I don't mind. I actually like building stuff. So it's a six easy use cloud based development tools that's actually available. So you can actually paste it on and code coding as well. So it's actually good for students of coding. And also you could remote control by using your smartphone. And it is very, very promising indeed. So this actually has a face object identification. Um, AI speech recognition and voice positioning and multiple sensory components uh, and so on. And um, if we actually go to the official website, which is very, very cool indeed. So please do check it out. I'm going to actually put the link down below. It's the Robot Creator DX, uh, create your own robot. So this is actually going to be a customizable robot, but I don't know how much customization I could do other than the case painting which I don't think I'm gonna do anyhow. But if you scroll down, this is actually how it looks. So you can actually see that the robot arms is going to be very useful. I hope it could actually pick up objects. So perhaps uh, KB Robot could serve you drinks uh, standing next to you or sitting next to you, should we say. Uh, so we've got a bit of a transparent kind of effect. I love that, as you know, and Wow, actually it does have wheels as well, so it, it will move around. I actually had the impression that it's only going to um, be stationary, but it will move around as well. Um, so you actually get all these, let's have a look, components and so on. And yes, it does look like a serious robot indeed. So I'm very, very excited about it. It actually has a home power button. So, and also micro SD card, wow, and camera in the front because it needs to recognize your face. It also has the listening LED indicator, so pretty much obvious that if you speak, it will be actually up and down letting you know. That's a very cool feature, I have to say. I've never seen any robot having the listening LED indicator. It has a seven inch uh, touch panel. I don't know whether it actually could play YouTube for me. That would be quite cool. We'll find out. PIR sensor, we know that PIR sensor basically means that it actually detects your movement to be able to react. That's actually used for a lot of lighting system in our industry and status LED indicator as well, maybe for battery charging, um, actually touch area for hands. All oh, right, so it actually could recognize your hand um, feelings, would it? Okay, and touch area for belly as well, so you could cuddle it um, and drop sensor as well. So this is a proper robot, probably one of the most expensive proper robot that I'm gonna review on my channel. So I think it's on its way. Um, it also has a touch area on the head. So head, belly, and also the arms, uh, hands. And it has the ear, but I don't think the ear itself is gonna be the, is it or is it not? Maybe, we'll, we'll see. Um, be the part where it actually listens to you, it has a microphone as well on the back of the head um, and touch area on the cheeks as well. So we've got one, two, three, four, um, one, two, three, four touching areas. So that's really, really good. It's probably one of the best robots that is available 
at the moment, I have to say. So the key features will be sound, lights, movement, recognition, intelligence, and emotion. So um, yes, I can't actually literally read out all these details, but overall, I'm very excited about this. So I don't know how many videos I'm gonna make out of it, but out of this whole delays of issues that we are, quite a lot of people actually come to my channel moaning about it, I do actually have a very good robot that I could share with my dear viewers out there. Once I receive it, I'll try to assemble it as soon as possible. And maybe we could actually go for the option of doing this live um, casting, uh, live stream sharing as well. So you guys could actually uh, come to my channel, ask me to do a few other stuff. You know, why not? That would be quite cool. But anyhow, I'm very excited about it. Please stay tuned and I'll try to come back to you as soon as possible with the updates on my community post, so please do check that out as well. But overall, the Kebi robot indeed is a very high-tech, proper robot that is still yet customizable, uh, that has a lot of uh, sensors and also a touchpad as well. So we shall see how good this is, but I'm pretty much convinced already that this is gonna be a very good robot indeed. Anyhow, look forward to review this and see you guys uh, later on on related to this robot and so on but if you have any queries any requests you want to make please do comment below and thank you very much for watching this video this is ljb tech all the best bye bye